Another Wednesday, as they were called, until they added the Sheffield bit in 1929, have been in existence since 1867. Their name originates from the day of the week on which they initially played their games. Believe it or not, it was Wednesday rather than their city rivals United who were originally nicknamed the Blades. They became the Owls in 1899 with the opening of Hillsborough, which is in the Olerton, get it, area of the city. They won the original First Division four times, the FA Cup three times, and this little beauty, the League Cup in 1991. In 1964, scandal rocked the club when players Tony Kay, Peter Swan and David Lane were implicated in a match-fixing scandal. They were sent to prison for four months and banned from football for life. They hold the record for the fastest ever shot in English football, a David Hurst 114 miles per hour thunderbolt in 1996, and the fastest ever sending off, Kevin Pressman trudging off with his tail between his legs in 2000 after just 13 seconds of one match. Wednesday have announced plans for a £22 million redevelopment of Hillsborough. But without a win so far this season, there hasn't been too much for Owls fans to shout about on the pitch. Manager Brian Laws saw encouraging signs in his side's midweek defeat to Newcastle, and it was his team who started the brightest, Richard Wood heading Wednesday into the lead after just six minutes. Luke Varney rejoined the Owls on loan from Derby in the week and made an impressive return, here setting up the Owls' second. Jermaine Johnson smashing home his fourth goal in five games. The Iron have conceded eight goals in their last three matches, and it was easy to see why. Only a heroic bit of defending from Rob Jones stopped the Owls extending their lead. It came at a cost, though. The former Hibernian defender could play no further part. Last season's top scorer, Marcus Tudgay, has yet to find the form that saw him score 14 goals last season. But generous defending like that will help his cause. The striker getting his first goal since signing a contract extension in the summer. And Tudgay was once again involved to seal Scunthorpe's second 4-0 defeat of the season. His deflected shot emphatically put away by Darren Potter to round off some scintillating football from the hosts. A first win of the season for Brian Laws, but an ominous sign of a long season to come for Nigel Atkins and Scunthorpe.